Hi everyone, it's Jay Witty. Hope you all are having a great day. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I'm glad you're here. So I'm working on a 12 by 16 canvas today and I uh, got this brilliant idea that I was gonna do uh, two split cups, one with two chambers and one with three. That color right there is the Deco Art Extreme Sheen Emerald. Love green, so this is really a pretty color. The next color is the Modern Masters Gold Rush, and I have a couple of drops of Deco Art Extreme Sheen 24 Karat Gold. So I'll be putting those two colors in the first uh, double chamber split cup, and I'm gonna alternate how I put those in, and you'll see here how I do that. Uh, the three chamber, I'm going to be using the Folk Art Color Shift Orange Flash. It has a drop or two of Liquitex Basics Candium Orange Hue in it. Uh, Deco Art Dazzling Metallic Pearl White. And Deco Art Dazzling Metallic Teal. All of my paints are mixed strictly with Floetrol. No water was added to any of them, including the base coat, which you're gonna see coming up here in a moment. So I'm gonna take those three colors and put those into the that cha those chambers right there. So one solid color per chamber. Um, the first one, I kind of alternate them and you'll see in a moment what I'm talking about. So I remove everything off the canvas and then of course my base coat I use Deco Art Americana Satin Dark Scarlet. I put a drop of Liquitex Basics Mars Black just to darken it and then some Artist Loft Crimson to kind of bring it down just a little bit. I think I put a little too much black but I came out with this really gorgeous red color and I love it. So I'm gonna be laying down my base coat, covering my canvas. Kinda wish I had uh, put this on my spinner and I didn't, but that's okay. Um, because ultimately I end up using my catalyst on this particular pour. So um, this is very different, the, but the colors are vibrant. The contrast is awesome. I do take you in at the end of the, the video to show you the uh, wet results and then again the dried results. Um, so here you see I'm going to lay down, I think I start with the gold. And so I fill up about half of that chamber with the gold and then I lay the emerald on top of that. And then on the other side I flip it. I lay down half the emerald and then half the gold. So um, I guess you would call it an infinity pour. I've never done it before. I was going to do a kiss pour, and then I kind of chickened out on that and figured I'm just going to swirl these two cups around at the same time on the canvas tilt and see what happens. And then I ended up playing with my catalyst. So I had a lot of fun. I really love the end results of this piece. It's just really, really different and really cool looking, in my opinion. So anyway, drop me a comment down below. Let me know what you think. Again, if you're new to my channel, welcome. I'm glad you're here. I do invite you to subscribe. Don't forget to hit that notification bell for future uploads. Give me a thumbs up, guys. Um, and again, I read all my comments and I do respond and I look forward to hearing from, that, um, from you all. So I appreciate each and every one of you. So I'm gonna let you sit back, watch the rest of the video. And until next time, guys, stay safe, take care, and blessings to you all. Bye-bye.